Hey, look what I did. I took two idioms and turned them into a proverb. A man of few words can more easily be a man of his word. Well, you know why that is? Because a lot of people keep their mouths shut for one of two reasons. Either they've got something to hide or they just don't want to get caught up in their own web of lies. Yeah, some of these tight-lipped folks are like the Fort Knox of secrets, keeping it all locked down. I know, I know, of course some people are just socially awkward, but with a lot of quiet folks I just can't help but thinking, what? All they can think about are things that they're not supposed to talk about? Eh, what's the deal? All their thoughts are words they can't say? But then you have the other group, the ones who should take a damn lesson from this. These are the people that have no filter, no pause button, no mute option. They just keep yapping away, filling the air with more bullshit than a politician on election day. You know the type. You see them at the family gatherings, the office. Hell, they're everywhere. These are the people who think that every thought that crosses their mind is a precious gem that the whole world needs to hear. Newsflash, folks. Just because you have an opinion doesn't mean it's valuable. Sometimes, silence is golden. I mean, take a break, give the rest of us a chance to enjoy some peace and quiet. Because honestly, if some people could just learn to keep their mouths shut every once in a while, just every once in a while, this world would be a much quieter, saner place. And maybe, just maybe, they'd be a little more trustworthy. Because remember, the less you say, the less you have to remember. And judging by the way some people run their mouths, they've already got enough trouble remembering what day it is.